guys, it's Pazzo. Welcome to our YouTube channel. Uh, today we're going to do just some Halloween looks, I guess, really. We're not going to do anything too difficult no. um, because a lot of the stuff that we've seen are a bit more the special effects oh, yeah. kind of base thing. So we yeah, kind of yeah. want to do classic, fun looks, but something that's still achievable for you guys to do. Easy but effective. Simple but effective, yeah. Yes. 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 Definitely. So we've already primed. So I use the primed... Prime down ready. Uh, reviving and anti fatigue illuminating primer in Cool Rose. And I just use the Lasting Finish 8 Hour Wear to New Thing um, by Rimmel London. Really good product. And yeah, we're fully primed ready. Yeah. And then we're going to crack on. So I'm going to be a cat. And I'm going to do a witch, but I'm going to do like some sort of contoured witch. We'll see what happens. But Sexy I'm be a witch. cat, like we said, classics, yeah. but, with but fun. modern spin. Okay, so for starters, I'm going to start with my eyes first. I just already primed them, ready to go. Um, I'm going to go in with the Morphe 35V v palette. And I'm just going to use the... I would pick it up, but we've got a lot of makeup in front of us. It's a bit treacherous. And I'm just going to use the Sand and Matte Black shade. And I'm just going to build a bit more of uh, an outer crease. I'm going to go in with the Zoeva Blanc Fusion. So this is a triple set that I got from our friend Sophie. And I'm going to go in the shade Last Bite. So it's not quite black. It's like a dark mauve, I would say, like a purpley black. So I'm going to start with that and then build it up with black after. Okay, so I'm going to just blend this out a bit more just so that it becomes a bit lighter. And then I'm going to go in with a thinner brush. And just to um, make this bit stand out a bit more down here. Looks good then. Yeah. Okay, so we've both worked a little bit of magic. We've both gone for the black look for now. Um, what I'm going to do next, I've, I've just kind of shaped my eyes a little bit. I obviously, I haven't finished yet, but I've just buffed the black out as much as I can until I add the green on. For the green, I'm going to go in with our beautiful Jaw Raker palette. And we're going to go in with the shade Sour. And I'm just going to use this MAC flat brush and just apply that on my lid and then eventually blend that with the black. I'm going to go in back in with the Morphe palette in the shade, I think it's Crush, which is a purple palette, purple colour. Um, like I said, we can't pick it up because there's everything everywhere. Um, but I'll be applying that down here. And just before I do that, I'm going to go in with eyeliner across my top lid just to make my eyes stand out a bit. Okay, so as you can see, both Zoe and I have added a little bit more to our eyes. So I'm just going to go in just with my Maybelline gel eyeliner and just kind of add a bit more shape to what I've already created so far yep i'm gonna go in with some glitter just a white or a light glitter not sure which one yet um just to put in my inner corner there and just on my top lid slightly okay so what we did is um to add some color to our eyes we used the little mac in the shade ice so that's both of us yes yeah, so you've used it i don't know if you can see guys but she, zoe's used it right there in the corner and then brought it up to a little bit towards her eyelid and then i've just added a bit more of a glitter um just to make mine look a little bit less dark dark yeah so uh we've just added some glitter on there but um i'm just going to go in first just with some white facial paint this is classic Snazzaroo. colors snazaroo yeah snazaroo uh, just white and i'm just using a wet old sponge and i'm just going to apply this all over my face i'm going to use a really like a smallish brush just add a few features to my face and my cat, so like whiskers, blah, blah. Um, and this is old. Um, this is from Grimace. So I don't even know if they make face paint anymore. Um, but yeah, just a black. So here we go. A mess. I'm very white. Help me. It looks like a moustache. What? <laughs> my lip. It does, it's like a little Super Mario moustache. It's a me, Mario. Okay, so as you can see, I'm very, I look like Zoe now once she's done her foundation. <laughs> and Zoe's done her lips and her nose and her whiskers. Things. What things? Where well, the whiskers come out of, I don't really know what they're called though. Whisker holes. Whisker holes. Um, so that, oh, oh, that. next we're now gonna contour. I'm gonna go in with a black paint. And then I'm going to try and mix a little bit of green to make it kind of match my eyes. But we're going to see how I go. I'm just contouring normally with my Hoola um, bronzer. And then I will be... I'm not baking today. Are you baking today? Am I baking today? <laughs> Is that a joke? I'm not baking today. So yeah, I'm going to go in with my Hoola um, 
bronzer and then I'll add a bit of highlighter and then once I've contoured I'll then add my whiskers because I wouldn't want to ruin it that's all so I'm just gonna watch how um, Paris gets on with this first. I'm already struggling I can't do the sponge I'm trying, trying to bend it so I can add the contour I might have to use a different sponge and then once I've contoured I'll be adding my brows just wanted to I could just get that in there you know what I might do it with a brush have you got a brush what brush did you use for the black did you use brush for black for your lips yeah that one there. and then I just use a sponge to blend it out there we go so I'm gonna use a little makeup uh makeup brush dip that in my black paint prepare for the worst thing ever contour's done Okay, so as you can see, we're looking a little bit different. Mine did go a bit wrong, but then I have never done this before, but we're there now. So as you can see, I've blended a black and a green to kind of contour my jawline as well. I would do the rest of my neck, but that's too much effort. Uh, just to kind of match my eyeshadow. So I think it's coming together slowly. So I'm going to just use this, this, this uh, Lime Crime lipstick. I don't know what the colour's called, but it's like a deep, deep red burgundy colour just to... Slightly brighten up my look, but not too much. I'm going to do my brows. Paris decided there's no point doing hers because, you know. So I'm going to go in with my normal pomade and just an angled brush. Just draw over my normal brow. Not going to exaggerate or anything like that. And then for a lipstick, I'm going to go in with the Ink Credible. I think it's called Off The Hoof. So yeah, I'm going to put that one on and then we'll come back and see what that looks like. All right, so we've added our lipstick on. I think my lips have kind of draw my look a bit more together so yeah but your lipstick looks amazing with yours it looks pretty cool really matches the purple quite well loving it so now we're going to go with some eyelashes um where did you get these from primark 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 what she means an educated child um yeah we've got good versus evil i don't know which one's the good and which one's the evil but either way we both like the lashes i'm going to go with the top ones and so it's going to go with the bottom yeah so I don't, you never really wear like um like a thick, crazy pair. No, I normally wear natural looking ones, but the top ones aren't really natural looking either. So, but yeah, I normally go for sort of yeah feathery. Yeah, they're yeah. not they're not too in your face like full on. I can't can't do them. Yeah, no, I don't think they suit my face. That's fine. Well, I think you're gonna go something a bit different today. I think we we're are, gonna yes. look great. Yeah. So good versus evil. I don't know which way around now, but yeah, that's us. Okay, so that is both of our looks successfully completed. Um, I mean, I like the fact we've gone for something completely different as well. Yeah. It's pretty cool. Like, obviously, Zoe's gone for the sexy cat, which a lot of girls tend to do at Halloween. So, if you want to have a bit of an idea of what to do, here's a good shot. I mean, you don't have to use purple, you could use green, pink, red, Any anything. Color. Yeah, I just. You, yeah, you did just rub your lips together. And then me, I'm like the tragic girl that like takes Halloween quite seriously <laughs> and will like turn up like in a massive suit or anything. But I, I quite like my look. I was a bit struggling, I was struggling a little bit. Uh, the lipstick definitely changed it completely. Yeah, I think you need to have, I mean, you could wear green lipstick, but unfortunately I haven't got green. Or purple. Or black. This this purple's the wrong purple, we decided yeah. that. It needs to be a matte. Either like dark, deep purple, Yeah. which I didn't have. But I thought the red looked quite good anyway, it looked quite cute. Um, obviously, I'm not, I haven't got a, I mean, if you're going to do paint your face, obviously try and get something quite high neck where you disguise your neck in with it. Don't yeah. wear something low unless you're willing to go that low and paint it the rest of it, then carry on. Yeah, you can I, I could not be bothered today. That was a, I was, like, I was just in my face and showed you the contour levels. They did get a bit crazy, so this side, this side did go a bit wrong, so that's my bad side. But this side went okay. But uh, I th I'm happy with it. Yeah, I'm quite happy with it. You look really cute, like weirdly cute. I'm uh, a the, cute the eyelashes are really nice. Yeah, they are nice actually. Yeah, and normally I'm that tra tragic girl that goes out dressed like this on Halloween with my sister. Yeah. But um, yeah, I think my my looks quite cute. I can't see in the mirror. Your looks very cute. But, yeah. Like well, if, if you had like the rest of the outfit on, like your you know the yeah, ears and like a cat ears. suit or something, yeah. and I had like my my green dress on with my broomstick and everything else. Yeah, would look definitely. Really good. Yeah, it would definitely make the look. But yeah. It was quite fun actually. Yeah, it's good doing a Halloween look for a change. Yeah. We might, we might do another one if we have time. Probably won't because Zoe's going on holiday soon. She's leaving me, so I had to be My in charge. <laughs> um, but yeah, I mean, 
let us know what you think about our looks, what we could have done maybe to do something a bit different. We may have time to try and do another Halloween look, but we can't guarantee. It just depends, doesn't it? Yeah, it definitely depends, yeah. But we can't, we're not going to say for definite, but if we do, we do. If we don't, then who knows? Our next look could just be whatever you guys choose it to be. So. Yes. And just don't forget to check out our Instagram. Yep. We'll definitely put, put pictures on of our looks um, just so you can see them up close and rather than us moving all the time. But yeah, that's it. that's it. Thanks for watching. Thank you. Oh my god, who are there? Who, who are you? <laughs> I'm no longer a witch. How's my face? Here you go. Wake up with a 10. No, go home with a 10. Wake up with a 2. <laughs> the inner witch in me. <laughs> okay, ready? Yeah. When you go home with a 10. Where we go with it? It is a phone recording. Yeah. Can <laughs> you stop it, babes? No. <laughs>